Taking a look at the package here, we can see that Be Quiet has always done a really good job on their packaging. It's a very informative, very colorful. On the front, there is a picture of the actual cooler, and it does let us know the TDP, which is 160 watts. Again, as I said, very informational. You know, there's a ton of information on here. Pretty much goes over everything. We'll, we'll get a close up here of our specifications so you guys can see that. But let's just go ahead and open this up. Um, I'm sure you guys wanna see what all comes inside here. So we'll go ahead and looks like this is a box. I'm assuming that's one of the fans. We'll go ahead and do the little flip and get everything out of here. So opening this up and as you can see, like I said, everything is nicely packaged and protected. So this is the actual cooler which we'll move out of the way here. This box here actually doesn't have a fan in it. I was completely wrong. It actually has all of your accessories. So we'll go ahead and open that up and see what we have here. Um, of course, very important, let's get this out of here, are your instructions. And you can see there are diagrams there to show you everything that you have that comes with it. And are there diagrams? Yeah, there are diagrams that actually show your installation as well. So that makes it very easy. Um, you know, if there's a CPU cooler, I would expect it to have, you know, some type of diagram showing you exactly how to install it. And of course you have all of your mounting hardware here, um, as well as some thermal paste right there. And that's about it for accessories. Let's go ahead and actually check out the cooler. Now, um, this is not a tower cooler, this is a top-down cooler, and you can kind of see the design of that rather than you know the top down or rather than the tower I mean so you know normally a tower takes up a lot of space and this allows you to you know have some pretty good cooling in a minimal amount of space so the way it works of course is your CPU is going to be down here you know it's going to generate heat that heat is going to be transferred up here um, through the large heat pipes which these are extremely large heat pipes as you guys can see right here um, four large heat, heat pipes will take the heat up into the heat sink here, which these are aluminum fins. Um, and then your fan, of course, is gonna dissipate all of that heat. And I believe this is one of um, Be Quiet's Silent Wing fans. So it's gonna be very quiet as well. Um, of course, named Be Quiet, you would expect their coolers to be pretty quiet. You can take a look at the fan there. Um, you know, nice fan. And you can take a look. Actually, it's pretty cool. There is a Be Quiet logo. And it's not just in there. It's actually like a 3D logo. You guys can see that really really cool if we take a look at the base here you can see that the heat pipes go directly into the base so that's going to make for a very you know very good heat transfer from the base to the actual uh, heat pipes we take this cover off here and you can take a look at the base nicely machined um, mirror finish very very nice um, very very nice cooler here so we're excited to check it out i can't wait to actually get it in a system and see how well it performs but this has been the unboxing and overview of the be quiet shadow rock top flow and again it's called top flow because it is not a tower cooler it's one of the ones of course that's going to work like this and of course it's going to give you more room in your case at you know tower cooler takes up a lot of space so remember guys if you like our unboxing videos why don't you subscribe as we look at the cooler itself, you can see why it's called top flow. Um, it is not a tower type cooler. So you're gonna have a heat sink stack going horizontally as opposed to vertically when you have a tower cooler. Now, of course, the way this works, we'll go over really quick is, of course, your CPU is gonna be down here, you know, under your CPU block, and that's gonna generate heat. The heat is gonna come up through the heat pipes, um, which are extremely large, you can see. Normally, you see six millimeter heat pipes. These are actually eight. Uh, millimeter in diameter, which is pretty large or larger than normal. Um, so they're going to take that heat and bring it up into the heat sink stack, which are aluminum fins, um, of course, and then that's going to help dissipate the heat. And then on top of just the heat sink um, itself, you are going to have a, a fan. And this is a 135 millimeter Silent Wings fan. Of course, Be Quiet is known for their cooling fans. Um, they are very quiet, of course, be quiet. You'd expect their fans to be quiet, but these are known to be very quiet. So on top of great cooling, you're gonna get a you know minimal noise. Well, that's really important because nobody wants this, you know, CPU cooler that sounds like it's gonna take off, you know. So that's really, really good. Um, 
And we can take a closer look here at the actual base. It is a thick base, pretty thick base, and you can see that the heat pipes go right into the base as well. And we can take off the covering here, and you can see that it is nicely machined, mirror-like finish right there, so you can have great contact on your CPU. But that is basically it here for the Shadow Rock Top Flow from Be Quiet. Make sure you check back very soon on Think Computers as we will have our full uh, written review as well as test and all that fun stuff. And remember guys, if you like our videos, why don't you subscribe? Catch you guys later.